was maybe another time Ronnie was thinking of this again. Maybe he was thinking of firing me. I don't know. I can't remember right now. But anyway, Roy came around, and I think this was like the second time that I'd, I'd ever met him. I didn't really hardly know him, and I saw him just play a little bit. But uh, he came, and we were playing, and he was sitting in. And this guy was like a gunslinger uh, coming up to, uh, into the town, right? So he got up and plugged in, and he looks at me like, you know. And so I thought, okay, you want to dance? Let's dance. Right. And, and I was just at the stage where I was starting to get pretty good, you know. I was still very young, you know, maybe se six, 17 years old, I think, by then. And and he did this thing, like, we started to play, and we were going to, like, swap solos. And he did this thing where it was like he was tuning the guitar while playing. It's and it was like Bruce Lee swinging around one of these things before he fights you. You know, it's like, by then, you're, like, horrified already from this. This man is just done before your eyes. So he did, like, all of these tricks, you know, weird sounds and bending things down and bending the neck and everything and playing with volume controls and and it was very a very frightening experience for me but uh, but he was a great guitar player from the beginning I mean it was like I don't know if he's any better now I think he was as good when he was born as he is now